Welcome back. Within next 3 minutes, I will add a toggle feature on existing dashboard sidebar using Next.js and Tailwind CSS. Here I have Next.js and Tailwind CSS dynamic dashboard menu which I created on the last video. You can find the link on the i button. Let's add the toggle feature on the sidebar menu. I created the dashboard frame on the layout file. But here I need a react state variable which only rendered on the client side. And layout cannot be rendered on the client side. That's why I'm moving this main part on our pitch.txx file. You can use a separate component for this too. Our nav will be relative. Next, adding an anchor. Here I need an arrow SVG. You can get arrow SVG from webgraphics.com at free of cost. Remove this part. Add our SVG width, height and fill color. Let's move this arrow in the vertical middle of the navbar. For that our anchor will be absolute with top 50%. Next add the background color and rounded the anchor from the top and bottom right part. Need to move this to the right side. For that I'm using minus right 10. To make it look good change the size of the SVG and add padding to the anchor. Here it is. Now I need a react set variable as toggle menu. Initially value is false. On click of the anchor menu, value will be changed as per the current state. If toggle menu is true, our nav width will be 0. It works but still the menu is showing. For that I need to hide the menu when toggle menu is true. Here I am using opacity. Now our section will be full width when toggle menu is true. Here it is. Also rotate the arrow as per the toggle menu state. To make it look good, let add transition and delay. Here is the final result. Thanks for watching. Please like and share. Let me know your opinion in the comment section. Don't forget to subscribe.